Now then guys, PT64 here. I hope you guys are all doing bloody fantastic. And we're back in. We are back in. We're going to get this inventory sorted. And then we're going to dive back through those holes. And we are going to see. Oh, I've got some shells up there. Shit. I didn't realise that. Um, you know what then? I'm going to use all the rags in it. Yeah. Um, instead of having them, hmm, let me think about this. Yeah, like I say, we're going to dive back through the holes and we're going to hit that ruin up and whatnot. I'm going to see what we can find there. Let's get the shovel repaired. Beautiful. Right. That can fuck off. That can get sold. Yeah, they're definitely going there. I knew those mushrooms would rot. That can go there. Everything back where it was. Beautiful. Um, the flares, I think, can probably come out now. Mm, how do I keep them on me? No, I will, just in case. Amazing. They can go there. Those I'll have to dump with the rest of them. Again, this tape, I really don't know if I if I need any tape. I'm tempted just to get rid of two of them and just keep three. Rags back in there. That'll just eat. I'm just going to have to eat that. Right, we're going to use that. Grab another in case we need I never put that down, did I? Fucking thing. And then we have got the most ridiculous amount. I bet we're not even going to be able to sell it all to um, to the three. But we're not going to even be able to sell it all. Something that we can also see if it's moved as well. That's sort of the bonus of that. I mean, if you're able to trap a load in there and then like go around hit them while they're in that room. That'd be pretty fucking sweet. Right, I'm going to refill. So that's those up there. We need to dump those and let's just start picking up a load of shine. Hello. Uh, I will most likely be buying some stuff off you guys. I always do. I'll definitely buy those. And then I'm going to start selling you some fucking pricey shit. Have to buy more stuff. We can take them, so I will. We can take them. Uh, what else? I can technically take them as well, but... And then them... Four point four thousand. Yeah, they're the things I want. That's gone into there. But the thing is, it's that's not even everything sold. Certain things will be able to stack, thankfully, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get away with actually selling everything, to be honest. They should be able to go, yeah, yeah, that can go in there. That should hopefully be able to stack. No, it can't. What about the tape? One of them can. Uh, we've got room for one more of them. Take some more boards, maybe. I say, because at this point really is buying for the sake of it. Scrap. Right, I think that is actually everything. I think we managed to get rid of everything. <laughs> no way. Right, let's refuel. Let's refuel. Then we can stack two together. Stick them back in. Job to them. Nice. Right. 
Oh, amazing. That's absolutely perfect. Can go in there. And I should see about using the hunting rifle with all this fucking ammo. They can start back in there. Okay. No, you are going to have to move. So I'll be going in there. I know I added two stacks, so I can go there. Six in spare. That was irritating, 12 nails. Right, we can just get rid of them, and we are good to go. Yeah. Let's add them to the pile. Right, and it's time for the hold. Quick save. Good old oven. Useless now, but it's good for saving. We are out of here. Ready. To call through shit. Oh my god, what the fuck? My holes! <laughs> Is that the... That's the My Holes man. Mine. He's not going to attack me, is he? No? Are we good? Are we chill? What the fuck? No wonder he's digging all holes. Big old centipede boy. Right, what we got then? Another ruin. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Ow, oh, that hurts so bad. What the fuck? Mate, what the fuck was that? How was he like doing some sort of fucking flash step teleporting shit? Riggedy wrecking me. Oh, well, we know what that is. Yeah, I had some nails, so I may as well take that. Shiny stone. Ah, uh, there's a heavy smell of gasoline in the air. This is going to fucking get me killed. That's why I dodged. That's why I fucking threw it and bailed as quickly as I possibly could. Definitely a chomper over there. I'm ready for that. But I'm also ready to see what's in this. So, if you would be so kind. Yeah, fuck you. I can reach. No, oh, no. I don't need, to, don't need to waste my resources on you now. Um, ah, okay. That's actually pretty sweet, to be fair. Because I didn't want to just rinse one of them straight away. It's all good. Right. Okay, so we've done that little uh, done that little one. There we go, then let's find out what this fucking place has got in store for us. Oh my fucking armor's gone. Really? That's going on. I need to try and remember to take it off as well. So I keep on rinsing. Oh shit, what am I doing? That didn't sound good. Whoa, I'd be lying if, if I said I wasn't unnerved. Come on, come around that corner, son. Clipped him at best the first time. Anything else in here? Another watch. Mm, I'll take them for now. I can always just use them just to get rid of them. But it is a healing item after all. And apparently, Mr. Centipede is not limited to the night time! He was fucking ready. He just fully had my number. What's he 
doing? Oh, he's having a nibble! Not anymore, it's not. What was that? What the hell? Oh, it's a human spider. Oh, there's two. Shit, there's two. Yeah, that is going to call for a uh, Molotov. Enjoy it. Enjoy it, son. Oh, God. What? At least we both missed, eh, mate? You're done. Jeez, I've got no armor. I need my fucking... Oh, where is it? I need my meat armor. Give me back. Did we get him? We fucking did. Took you down, didn't I, dickhead? God, horrendous. Didn't give me a chance to do anything. Fabric and another shovel. A bit of wire. Is there anything else in here? Shroom is. Suppose you can stack. Fucking killing them chompers brought the spiders a call in, didn't it? They loved it. Well, that's the ruin done. Right, so before I forget, you can come off of there now. For the amount of reputation that shiny stone can piss off. For the amount that I've already got, it's insane. So it can do one. Um... Right, if that's there, let's try going over east. I'd quite like to head over here and see. I'm very curious. See if we can find the elephants down here. So I can't remember which side. I don't know if it's going to be over the other side of that ruin, like tucked in the corner. Don't like this. No, because I'm down here, aren't I? So I'm not. I can't be up to the Great Lake. It's getting pretty dark. Really? Ah! Fucking bastard. What? What's going on? I'm gonna say, I can't fucking see it! Oh, come on, man! Really? That is fucking crippling. I cannot believe that it just happened. No, we didn't mean to do that. We got wrecked. Got absolutely fucking wrecked by that. We can free up some inventory space at least. That is one massive bonus. Spare shovel, do one, do one. So much for fucking healing. The rest of the stuff I've lost. I've lost so much fucking stuff. Armour, you can go back on. Right. All my spare fucking shotgun shells, they're all gone. So what I'm going to do, for the time being at least, is swap my weapons out. I'm going to take that sweet bad boy. I'm going to reload up on them. And we are fucking ready to rock. I'm not letting that death slow me down. It's a shame, but it ain't slowing me down. No way. I will take my stuff back and I will kill that stupid fucking lizard man. This rifle. Right, where was it? Lost inventory there. So pretty much if I had... 
straight northeast. We should get to it. There's that path. I don't know where the path is. I thought we are pretty much back already. I don't know where I am, though. I followed the path, though. So if I... Aha! Boom, there we go. I'm not going to worry about the order yet. Probably get fucking killed again, but... What? Great, it's just come to an end. Over here, Swamp Cottage. Oh, hang on, could be onto something here. Can't see a goddamn thing. That's better. Fucking hell, that's better. Could not see a fucking thing. With flowers. Oh, tractor. Fuel and even more scrap. Jesus Christ. That looks like it's old shed. That looks like he's heading away though. And I'm fucking running out of time. I can't forget, like, that death. I need to get in here. There's gotta be a way in. Keep circling round. We haven't been all the way around it. Barbed wire and whatnot. Some serious defences around here. Even though I've nearly gone all the way around it, that's not good. That's, not, that's really not good. Please don't. Please don't let me die again. Nah, I can hear a fucking swamp for now. Stay the fuck away from me. Jesus, what am I doing? Need to reload. Air traps. Fucking hell. Another one. Holy shit. Someone did not want stuff getting in. The cottage is surrounded by a barricade made out of old furniture and rusty barbed wire. Probably stolen from some fence. It's insane. Oh my god. Just when I thought I already had like too much scrap and then we find this place. It's got the most scrap. The most amount of bear traps I've ever seen anywhere. Easily. We are pushing it a bit for time. An intense smell of flowers fills the air. Not no. Locked, I need a key. Oh, someone is behind the door. Can you hear it? Shush. Hey you, what are you looking for here? You're not from that goddamn village, are you? Prove you're a good man. Fix our generator and I'll open the door. Fix the generator. 
consider it done. Easy. Oops, I need to turn it on. There you go. Just prove. Time's ticking, look. Come on, time's ticking. Thank you for fixing our generator. You can come in. The elephants, it is. Oh, shit. With the two kids as well. The air is filled with a suffocating sweet odour of rot. Who are you? The woman is wearing a heavy ruined coat. Her voice is suppressed by the cracked gas mask she's wearing. Can't you speak? Did someone take away your voice? Two children hide behind the woman. The younger one eyes me nervously, cowering in fear. The older one just stands there, motionless. You're not from around here. I would have recognised you. We may keep to ourselves, but I know everyone here. I would never forget your mug. The younger child pierces me with his eyes. With its eyes. The steamed visor of his gas mask betrays his rapid breath. Your gob looks like that because of this fiendish air, do you know? I bet you can't speak, because you didn't keep your mouth shut when walking through the woods. The trees and plains are simply beautiful here, and the bushes bloom gorgeously this time of year. But don't let that charm of this land deceive you. The devil lurks between the trees and he gets to you through your mouth and nose. The older child's grasp on his mother's hand tightens. He does not lift his gaze from one of the hut's walls. And, you're going to stand there? I know you want something, you leper demon. You're not getting anything from us. I don't trust you, leper gob. Do you hear me? I don't trust anyone who breathes this filthy air. The woman stares at me intensely through the cracked mask. Did you take my Marcinek? If you... It, was it you who kidnapped him? Talk! As always, apologies for the terrible pronunciation. No, that can't be. The woman stares at the floor. Her greasy black hair drops down on her mask. It's impossible. Stupid child. He went out and never came back. But he was on about how his granny will take care. Will take him mushrooming. I have no idea where he... I told him he cannot go outside. I told him that the devil will find him. Take off his mask and take him away. I would look for him, but... She lowers her head even more, as if observing the dead flies stuck up to her coat. You want my trust? Bring my Marcinek back. My stupid Marcinek. Find him and bring him home. Here's the key to his room. He was spending a lot of time there recently. Maybe you'll be able to find something that'll lead you to him. Oh, the road. I remember this road. The woods devoured it about three years ago. It used to lead to our village. I walked it to school. The woman stares at the photo, hypnotized. The road home. My road home. Apart from these two here, and Marcinek, there's one more boy of mine, my precious darling, a blessed child. The woman rests her hands on the oxygen tanks of the children standing behind her. He look, his love fills our tanks with clean air. For this, we are forever grateful to him. For the clean air, for the oxygen tanks, for these beautiful masks and the book, in which the devil has revealed his true image, along with his evil plan. My son took it away from the trees with his own hands and brought it here to us. You're just lot like these lunatics who roam around the woods searching for God knows what. There used to be more of them. Guess most of them starved to death. I remember when they appeared not far away from here. Must have been around two years ago. Around two dozen of them. They were led by these three weirdos dressed in old rags. They set up a camp in the marsh there between the trees. They watched our house, stared right into my window as the oddities. I thought they wanted to kidnap my children or harm them some way. But the night fell, I lost sight of them, and there was no one there in the morning. Something exploded in the western part of the swamp, made the ground tremble. Devil knows what it was. I see you're curious. Investigate it if you have a death wish. I think it happened in the junkyard. I wonder if that was Piotrek fucking touching down. The youngest child hidden behind the woman's back until now finally finds the courage to make a small step toward me. One little bear ate a little soup. A faint voice could be heard. Then another one came and... Quiet! The woman smacks the boy in the back of his head. The punch is so hard the hood of his rubber cloak lands on the mask's visor. Not now. Not in front of a stranger. Hmm. Okay. Fair enough. Well, the one thing I do know is we need to get the fuck out of here. Yeah, we 
really could do with getting the fuck out of here. Not given the key. What we got? Drawings. Mushrooms, mushrooms everywhere. An old doormat. I think someone uses it as a bed. Small bundle. A map. A mushroom. Anything else around here? No? Is there nothing else? I just want to check. I know we're coming back at some point, but. No, nothing. Fair, right, okay. We need to get the fuck out of here now. Right now. Right, right now. Is there a. Is there not another way out of here? Uh, there really isn't. We're not too far away from the holes, but... No! Come on! Don't fucking do this! You stop! No, please, don't do this. Oh. Now the chair! You've got to be kidding me! This is fucking pissing me off! This is just ridiculous. Are you fucking really doing this to me? That is bullshit. I'd be surprised if we even fucking make it back in time. Properly. I must return to my... I know! Oh, trust me, I know, son. Trust me, mate. I know all too well. Problem is, I've got no fucking stamina. I'm stuck in this fucking stupid water. Thankfully, as soon as we get to the holes, we're as good as back. That's the massive bonus. But again, it's just... It's unrelenting. It's unrelenting. The stupid fucking swamp water. Right, we're here. We're back at the holes. We're good. We're good. We're good. Irritating that. Jesus. Ooh, that was close. Right. Okay, so. Anything that we just need to drop down for selling purposes? Yes. We'll have a bit of that. We'll have a bit of that. I'll just eat the other one as well. Fucking why not? Right. Um, hmm, just in case of multiple enemies, I think I will go back to the shotgun for now. Course. Let's have some of that. There you go, that's where I wanted to put them. God, I don't need that extra wire, really. Um, the fuck can I hear? What can I hear? Seriously. I'm missing something else. Even more scrap and whatnot. This is fucking insane. Right, what time's it? Shit! That'll do. Fuck me. That'll do. Go, 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 go. Quick, go, go. Pull it in, pull it in, pull it in. Right, nothing's getting through there. Glass is still there. You know, just drag that out of the way. That'll do. That'll do, yeah. Alright. Probably forgot something, but we've got flares and whatnot. And silly amounts of scrap metal, apparently. See, I'm burning through these now. Burning through the shotty shells now with all that fucking. all those enemies. My god. What have we got in store for us this time? Oh no! No, the birds. I can hear it as well. That just that faint on the wind scream. Yeah, it's banshees. It's fucking banshees. Definitely. Thankfully, we can't see me in this corner. Yeah, he's come inside. Definitely in here. 
I don't believe they snap traps, but they also don't break down doors or anything, as we've seen so far. It's like, you know, the current analysis on Banshees, they they always have to have assistance to get to you. So I guarantee there will either be human spiders or wolves or just something else that gives the Banshee the ability to get to us inside here. Will they get into me? That's the question. Fuck. Ghosts. Flares ready. Got the flares ready. Ah, oh, we've still got a light, so we're alright. The bonus of having two lights in here. Just in case you're not quick enough for the flares. We've got a like one in three chance. Well, like two in three, sorry, two in three chance. To be all good. Should be close enough to it as well, they shouldn't get me. If you throw something else into the mix now, we'll be in a, we'll be in big trouble. If we get banshees, ghosts, and then something trying to let the banshees in, we are going to be in for a bad time, a really fucking bad time. The amount of flares I've got, I'm tempted just to pop one anyway. To be completely honest. Super tempted just to pop one anyway. I think save messing around. If something starts banging, trying to get in, I'll drop one down. Never gone out. See, that's already moved. That's already been pushed in a bit, look. Because that was on an angle. I'm sure the Banshees have already been pushing against this wardrobe to see if they can get in. I've no doubt the Ghosts will have a third attempt. Yeah, I reckon I'm adamant they've already, if they're not already still pushing on it, you know. I really hope that doesn't give it. I was just looking, it doesn't look like... Yeah, I was just about to say, that's too far away from me, that's they're going to start having a bang on me. And it'll like it hit that as well. Yeah, I have to lean in for a moment. That is still moving. It is actually still moving, I'm sure it is. I swear that keeps getting pushed more and more and more into here. God, I hope that doesn't give way and end up coming through. Because that'll be fucking bad. Look, see, look, look. Oh, this is really bad, this. This is really bad. Can I push against it? Fucking can. It's right next to us. In there. If it looks through, it can still have a scream. If it looks through the gap at me, peeking through, if it comes into this line of sight here, it can still come at me. Thankfully, I can push against the wardrobe if they start trying to break into it again. But that ain't gonna be necessary. Fuck you, Banshees. Fuck you. Day 24. Oh, ho, noise. Yeah, they totally fucked with my wardrobe there. Properly. Properly fucked with it. Sneaky bastards. Sneaky bastards. But I don't believe any traps went off or anything. Pretty sure we're good to go. I don't think we had any problems. Right, they can go back in there. They can go back then. Nothing to worry about. They can go in there. Amazing. They can stack. Insane with all this scrap. It's mental. It's absolutely mental at this point. It's fucking crazy. 30 there and then all this. I mean, I suppose we are needing, like, less and less and less of other stuff. But wow. I mean, that's the inventory sorted, let's be honest. I mean, I don't even need to buy scrap off the three this time around. Which I'm just so used to doing. Am 
Madness. Absolute madness. Ammo as usual. I've already got a fucking shitload of flares. Don't need like anything else. And I think for the amount we've got, you know, we will take the hunting rifle out. We'll take that with us this time. Top that flare back up. We'll work through those. Yeah, three of those. We've got three bits for health. Keeping the shovel on me these days. So I've got a lantern. I think we're still good with that. Yeah, I think. I think we're good at that. In which case, guys, thank you so much for joining me for this episode, as always. And I'll catch you on the next one.